Today, we're going to be exploring the historic downtown of Matthews, North Carolina. Now, while we're uncovering some of its charm and unique pieces that make it truly what it is, we're also going to take a look at a home that's not your average cookie cutter. I'm your host, Kayla Lindsay with the American Dream. Let's go explore. So no visit to downtown historic Matthews would be complete without a visit to Moxie Mercantile. But if you take a look around, they sell everything from candles to clothing and more. Moxie Mercantile is really unique in a sense of they have guided principles within everything they do. And nothing proves that more than the giving back that they do, not only financially, but to the community. Most of the merchandise that you see in this building, as well as their two other locations here in, around the Charlotte area, are either women-owned businesses, women-curated, or women-made. Speaking of locally owned and curated here in Matthews, let's go check out a local jeweler that does custom jewelry just for you. Peterson Made is a local artisan with owner Barb Peterson. Barb Peterson does custom jewelry. Not only can she do permanent jewelry, but can also do things like fingerprints and laser engraving. If you're looking for something custom and the perfect gift for someone that you love, you definitely need to give Barb a call. Today, I wanted to take you on a quick tour of a home here in Matthews that brings the eclectic nature of the arts as well as architecture all into one. The cool thing about this, they did it with a home that was already existing. Let's go ahead and take a look. The quaintness of Matthews, North Carolina is truly captured in this home, starting from your beautiful covered front porch. As you walk through this five bedroom, three and a half bath home, you're gonna notice that not only does it bring relaxation, but it also fosters community and gathering. Everyone knows the kitchen is where people come to gather. Well, this particular home kept that in mind in their design. In fact, they have the largest island I think I've ever seen in a home and made sure not only it was a usable space with exceptional amount of cabinetry and working stations, but also made it a warm, comfortable place to call home and have friends and family. Now you're gonna notice this in the rest of the house as we go on a quick tour. This magnificent home is 3,200 square feet, but here's the cool part. It actually has two primary bedrooms, one on the second floor and one on the first floor. Not only does it open with double doors into a beautiful, large, hard floored bedroom, but also has an open patio with your own bench swing. Opening up into the bathroom, you have the largest jacuzzi tub you've probably ever seen in your life. The entire house has been designed to make sure you have spaces for not only entertainment, but relaxation. Whatever you desire to do, this home truly has it. The kitchen and backyard areas are absolutely beautiful. In this particular backyard area, not only is there a covered porch equipped with everything you need for an outdoor grilling experience, they also went so far as to extend the deck, add a beautiful shed and water feature. What better a place to end our tour than Seaboard Brewing and Wine Bar? Not only do they brew their own beer on site in their five barrel beer room, they also have brick oven pizza on site. So if you're looking for just a little snack and a place to hang out with your friends and family and pick up the lost art of conversation, this is the place to do it. So as you can see, Matthews and the downtown area have plenty to offer. Whether you're visiting for the weekend, hanging out in the sunshine or the rain, we've got something to offer. Until next time, this has been Kayla Lindsay with the American Dream. Cheers. <laughs>